The Good Morning America anchor posted the mother and son workout videos to her Instagram stories on Wednesday. Deborah, 62, began the videos by showing herself and Nick, 20, walking to and entering the gym. Seemingly pumping herself up, the broadcast journalist stated, All right, Fit Nation, you ready? Nick responded, Yes, as he pulled the door open and the pair walked inside. Deborah pointed the camera at their fitness trainer, Don Scott, and said, Let's do it. The next video showed the World News Tonight weekend anchor and her 20 year old son swinging kettlebells as they warmed up for their workout. Deborah sported a camo print tank top that showed off her defined arms and black gym shorts that flaunted her legs. Nick wore a blue t shirt and a pair of gray shorts as he exercised beside his mother. Deborah could be heard encouraging Nick to pick it up as they swung the weights from between their legs up past their chest. The following recording, captioned, Swinging into shape, captured the pair picking up the intensity as they moved the handled weights. In a video captioned, Form is key, Nick was shown performing hit thrusts with the assistance of the trainer while Deborah was seen doing back exercises with a dumbbell. The two reconvened to hold planks together, and Nick was later shown running on a treadmill as his mother did a chest workout with resistance cables. Deborah finished the workout by performing one legged push ups. She then added a photo, captioned, Yesus, that featured her and Nick flexing their biceps after they completed their gym session. Earlier this month, Deborah pulled a muscle while running through New York City. Deborah revealed that she struggled to complete her workout run because she almost injured herself in a video she posted on her Instagram stories. Deborah's skin and t-shirt were drenched in sweat as she took a walk break before she began running again. She explained the reason why she slowed her pace, divulging that it had suddenly become uncomfortable for her to run. I thought Nick, running buddy, and I were running together, and so, I tried to catch him, the ABC personality said, out of breath. All of a sudden, the area behind my right knee buckled. I don't know what that tendon is, but that's not good. She added that she was going to walk it off and pick up in a second. Later stories showed a snap of Deborah back running with the caption, trying to get going again. A video after that included in her stories was of Deborah admitting that she was able to finish her run, completing it after her running partner Nick finished his. Deborah's leg injury followed her hubby Al's, 68. Latest knee issues. All is currently recovering from his second knee replacement surgery. Deborah admitted in March that though she fell off the wellness train, she was dedicated to getting back on it. Deborah posted a series of videos and photos on her Instagram stories to give her followers an inspiring speech about determination and running in March. In the first video, she said, Good morning. How are you? So, I don't know about you, but I have been falling off the wagon a lot lately. Cold weather, Rainy weather, just don't feel like it. It's so easy to just say, not today. But each journey starts with one step, right? So, one step, let's go get it done. Deborah captioned the video, Friday finish. She then posted several photos of her running in New York City while wearing a navy puffer vest and matching cropped leggings. By the way, have I ever mentioned that it's not just about the run when you're out, or the walk? It's about this. The second video is of the amazing view she has while running, and it's captioned, taking it all and she then posted several photos from her run of the flowers blooming in Central Park.